Allow me to lead the way. I can take you to our destination by the optimum route. To charge ahead may be to rush headlong into danger. Let us take care to move as one. Be sure to keep your wits about you. I grant your weapon a magic Let us try for the same result with our next attack. Some variety would be nice, if we must fight. Master, a treasure chest. We shall have to find a way to reach it. Allow me to lead the way. I should like to put my knowledge to good use. Well, if you insist. I'm only glad I don't have to lead the way for a change. Cannot break it from this side. Perhaps.
One can never have too many materials. I'll harvest some now. So, another comes seeking to inter me. Yet your wicked schemes will avail you not, watching one. Time and again have you sent unto me your minions. Yet repel them I have, and so I shall anew, till I might claim the true world as mine own. Why do you not draw your blade? This battle shall be o'er before it has even begun! You seek not my death. Oh. Then you are not of the Watching One. I am Rothas, founder of the Kingdom of Vermund. And you appear to be a reason. Tell me your reason for coming here. God's way. Hmm. Speak you of those trinkets conjured by the wizards of Batal. Even from these depths, I have beheld the Batali scuttling about, gathering their fragments. It is a baleful, maddening act to transmute the fractured souls of Arisen into such frivolous baubles. Aye, that which you seek is a soul much like your own. Yet rarely will you find one intact, for splinters are all the remain of those pitiful arisen who were bade come here by the Watching One to end me. The flesh may rot, the soul fragment, yet power, power endures. And would seem the Batali seek to augment this power through their perverted arts. Though to what nefarious end, I know not. Yet it is folly, the frolicking of children. Such a trinket could ne'er hope to fell the dragon, let alone the watching one. I know little of your intent, but I sense in you a powerful will. A will that urges you towards fulfillment of some great feat. I shall grant you this blade. It too is the soul of an arisen. Mine own, in fact. Refined in purest dragon blood. Alas, the ages have taken their toll. Tis as withered as mine own flesh. Yet, mayhap, the Batali's profane magics would be capable of drawing forth its late potency. If that is what you seek, Arisen, then go on to their stronghold. I believe tis there you shall find the means to achieve it.
Sir Fulvio, the artist whose service Sir Clark commissioned, is residing in Batal. Shall we go and meet with him? If you wish to meet with this person, I would gladly lead the way. The vanguard is yours. Lead on. No sense.